If you enjoy my videos, don't forget to hit subscribe and click the bell so you never miss a single video. Hello my salty beans, my name is B and welcome back to another Roblox video. I am still a little bit sick, as you may already know, but nonetheless, we are here guys. We are in Roblox, we are in Bloxburg and I am so excited guys. Last episode, we decorated our house for Christmas and I showed you around our brand new house and i think you guys really liked it and i'm really glad you did so today guys we're almost ready to move in but there's one more thing we need to do in this house before moving day we need to christmasify my children's bedroom because i want my child when they move in to feel super christmasy and excited because it can be really scary sometimes when you move into a new house if you don't have nice things in the place and you don't you know it's, it's just scary because you're going to move away from your friends you're going to start a new school and all of it is quite scary so i decided it would be really nice if my kids bedroom had really nice christmasy ornaments in it ready for christmas so they felt excited and hopefully it distracts them a little bit away from being scared to move to a new place. So guys, we have $49,000. I don't think we're going to need all of that to Christmas if I one bedroom, but you never know. So let's head on over to build mode and we will go into my children's bedroom, which is this one over here, you may remember. And then also we need to sort this garden out eventually, but obviously I'll get the builders to do that. So in my children's bedroom, it's quite plain at the moment, as you can see. And I want their bedroom, first of all, I think we'll change the color of the bed because it's a really ugly color. Can I change? Oh, I can't change the outside colors. I wonder if there's a nicer bed, because I think that their bed's quite ugly. Do you guys think their bed's quite ugly? Because I do. Should we make the bed match the carpet? That would be nice, wouldn't it? We'll make it like a different type. Cool. I do think that their bed's quite ugly though, so let's see. Is there a nicer bed in that style? No, they're all kind of ugly, aren't they? Um, and I like this bunk bed better than the other ones. Oh well, that's fine. Um, let's go ahead and start decorating for Christmas. So if we go into the new section, here's all of the brand new Christmas de decorations in the new update. And let's start off over here on the desk with a nice Christmassy snow globe. I love snow globes. My sister in real life actually collect collects snow globes. She has hundreds on hundreds of snow globes, guys. So let's have a couple of... Oh, we can't put them on top of there. I've already looking weird. So it hangs over the edge. That's okay. So we've got a snow globe in here. I want my children to have their very own Christmas tree as well. So if we go over to... Oh, oh. Oh, well, that's a bit big, isn't it? <laughs> Not that one. If we go over to the normal Christmas tree, let's find a place for them to have it. I don't mind if it's in front of the window, but it'd be better if it wasn't. Maybe there next to the door. Nice Christmas tree in their bedroom, guys. I think that's really nice because the bedroom can be quite plain sometimes. So I think it'd be nice for it to be nice and Christmassy. We'll have a couple of stockings on the wall next to the beds so that they can come down at Christmas morning. I'll fill them up with nice things. Oh, well, actually, Santa will fill them up with nice things as long as they have been good. Santa's sleigh? Oh, my goodness, it's massive. We don't want that in the bedroom. It'll take up all the room. Let's have a little gingerbread man in the corner. That'd be nice. They like gingerbread men. So let's have that underneath the stockings. That's lovely. And then let's see what else we've got. We've got some icicle lights. We don't really need lights in here. Oh, we could do some decorative garlands in here though. That'd be nice for them, wouldn't it? Can connect them all together like that and just have it go along the edge of the room. That's nice. Oh, let's do it all the way around. I'm being super extra special, guys, for my children because I think that they've been really, really good this year and they deserve lots of nice things for Christmas. So I'm going to do some nice decorations all around the room because they really deserve it. They've, my child has been really, really good. So there, we've got some nice garlands in the room. That's so pretty. Let's go back into the section and see what else there is. So we could have, oh, is it a full-sized reindeer? They could, they could sit, oh, they could have their own reindeer, you guys. Let's have a reindeer looking out into the window. They'll be really excited when they come in and see a, a big reindeer in there. Oh, snowman, an indoor snowman. Let's have an indoor snowman in the bedroom. That's amazing. I love it. Let's see. Gingerbread house. That's cute, but it's kind of one that you need to put on a table. And I don't really have anywhere that I can put it unless I take the garland away. I suppose I could put it on the floor. No, you can. You have to put it on a table. Oh. The thing is, if I put it here, it hangs over the edge, which looks kind of weird. Oh. If we pretend it doesn't go out of the wall, that kind of looks kind of cute. 
just sort of little sit in there, just little um, gingerbread house. Uh, let's see, what else? Oh, some gifts. We need some gifts because they have been really good this year, guys. So on top of the rug here, we'll just put a few gifts because they've been really, really well behaved and I want them to know that I'm really proud of them. So we'll put some nice gifts in here on the floor. Lovely. And let's see what else is there, because I would like some other things as well. Um, oh, stuffed Santa teddy. Oh, yes, that's perfect for the corner over there, look. Oh, that's so Christmassy. Oh, lovely. Oh, my gosh. Stocking mantle decor. Can I put that on my actual living room mantle? <gasps> yes. Yes, that's beautiful. They don't have a fireplace inside of their bedroom, as you can see. But that's okay. I don't think that the children needed a fireplace, so we didn't put one in. And also, it's not very safe to have a fireplace. A firewood rack. I need that in my living room as well. Just put a firewood rack. I'm getting distracted, guys, because it's so much nice stuff to put in the living room as well. Right. Next up, let's see. Should we put some icicle lights in here? I'm not sure. I'm on the fence. I'm not sure if I want icicle lights. I really wish I could put decorations on the bed. That'd be nice, but I don't think you can. Ooh, fancy Christmas present put that there as well. They've been really good this year, guys. So they deserve it. They deserve a nice fancy Christmas present. Let's also put, um, no, we won't have a ginormous inflatable penguin. I didn't realise it was so big. Um, let's see. Should we have some little icicle lights on the wall underneath the, um, the garland like that? Uh, I can't, I can't put one there. Well, that's nice, isn't it? Just on the wall. Oh, you guys, I love this. I love Christmas time. I love decorating for Christmas. Let's put one of those little star trees next to the desk as well. Okay, so we've got a little bit crazy and there's a lot of Christmas decorations in this room right now. So I'm, re but I'm really hyped, guys, because they're going to be so excited and I'm so I'm just so excited for Christmas, guys. And I really want my children to feel like Christmas is coming and be excited about it because they deserve it. They've been so wonderful this year and so well behaved. And I want Santa to bring them lots and lots of presents. So as you can see, the house is quite well decorated. So the bedroom has quite a lot of things in it. Obviously the kitchen has some things in there, but not much, but the living room, obviously this room has some as well, the dining room has some, but the living room is our Christmas central really with all the presents around the tree ready for Christmas morning and our nice pretty garlands. But of course I've still decorated the dining room for them to sit and have the Christmas dinner in. I'm so excited guys. I'm so, so excited for Christmas. Do you like my Christmas decorations? If you do, leave a comment down below letting me know what you think to them. Thank you so much for watching this episode of blocks bear guys if you enjoyed don't forget to leave a like don't forget to subscribe and click that bell so you never miss any of my future videos you guys i'm so excited because it's almost moving day and it means that because i'm going to be moving to this new town obviously i'm going to be moving into a new job i'm going to be moving my children to a new school i'm so excited because there's so much to do but i will see you in the next episode when we move and bring my children with me to see their new house for the first time. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.